Show day! Yeah. My 10 years of modeling with Zach, that means 20 seasons. We have to do a little bit more smaller steps so it doesn't boomgy boot. Yeah, exactly. Coco, since she started modeling, has been in all of my shows and over the years has become a real friend. Years ago, I was so like I was so nervous before Fashion Week because you always had to look at your best. And you always have to be camera ready, so it's just like you feel a lot of pressure. I'm doing eight shows this season for Fashion Week. Basically, I'm working all month. Fashion Week is like a lot of energy, stress. You just have to be awake all day. Like you need beauty sleep. Did you guys get any sleep last night? Yeah. Four yeah. hours. Four. Uh, not you're always stressed and you're always a bit tired, but uh, at least we have like makeup to cover that, I guess. <laughs> at least we don't have to be on the runway. Nine. Because we're going to be late if we leave at nine o'clock. We used to be sort of infamous in New York for you know staying up all hours and having enormous production behind the scenes. The whole process of putting a collection together is really like a birthing. But at the end of the day, the most important thing is the collection. Can we add some looks? <laughs> Five more looks, we can do it. There's some alterations, but it's totally they you know what to do. Then I think we were gonna come stop by the space. I'm married to my manager, and he drives me to the shows too sometimes, because I bring a lot of stuff. He calls it traffic week. We might not make it. James might make it before us. It's like mm -hmm. maybe stop just like right before. I, I need to be shot by the photographers and stuff, so stop. Yeah. Not just right in front, just like uh, up a block. Up Thank up. you. Uh, Always have to be polite. I'm really excited to see what we going on later today. Hello. Backstage. Thanks. Hi. Welcome. Zach, like I met him the first time, I think it is show. It was like last season or the season before. The day of the show, it's really about the energy that I put out there in the world. I'm in touch with my models. You know, I think of what stories I'm gonna tell each one of them before they go out to help them get into character. When I walk in a show, I think of it as a performance. It's just a lot of fun. Sometimes work, when it's fun, doesn't feel like work. In the back, it's not like straight, it's just it fingers. Be back can be kind of loose. The elements that he's bringing out, the collection, there's a beautiful simplicity. This is this, is this morning's makeup. I feel very, very lucky right now. <laughs> the calm before but the storm. Like, Which way is the entrance? This that way. That way, okay. Right there. Got it. Once you get into the show, you have about three, four hours. So you better know what you're doing. Which way do we go? This is a disaster, so give groups of people, say, check all the bodies, you know, and check all the lips, and make sure that nobody's smudged your lipstick or what you know. Anything that can go wrong, you think about it. If I can pass this test, I have made it as a model, I guess. I mean, the funny thing with doing a show is, you know, you're backstage, and really in the blink of an eye, the show is over. The context of a show and the hair and makeup and the look of the girls is absolutely essential. It's all about the perfection, the visual, sensory. It's about making the model look incredible. We are the canvas and the designers are the ones that are painting on us. Welcome to the scene. It's kind of sweet and kind of frightening. This makes a statement. 